Kendall, after being home for, for two weeks like this, does Justin have to go back on the road? Yeah, I mean, it'll be different for us. I think it's a really big road swing. I mean, they're two good teams, and it's only our second road trip, I'm pretty sure, so it'll be a good test for us. After getting that triple-double Saturday, when did you finally sit back and realize kind of what had, what had happened? Uh, or did you? I don't know. I mean, I guess that night, you know, I was, I'm, I don't know. I was excited I got it, but, you know, I just have to move on. It's not, like, the most important thing that's ever happened. So, you know, I can't worry about it. Just focus on games. Now that you guys are, are 16 and 2, you guys have won you know, several games. How, how do you keep this thing rolling? I mean, how do you guys keep from, from getting complacent and you know, not challenging yourselves? Uh, I think, you know, we just can't be satisfied. We know that we have to get better every single day. We can't worry about like what everybody else is doing. We have to focus on ourselves and just come in every day ready to work and just play hard. When you guys lost Mike early in the season, did you think that at this point you'd be 16 and 2 and then, you know, 7 0 conference and have this kind of wing streak going? Uh, I never thought we would be this successful. And, you know, I'm really surprised, but I'm really pleased with, you know, how everybody stepped up and played and you know, the wing streak that we have going. What can you say about the newcomers and the way they've stepped up in their first year? No, they're not pressuring anymore, I think. They've just been even the two. And they've all been playing well and they play hard, and I think they play their roles well. Do you or any of the other girls start looking at any, any of the bracketologies at this point and kind of at large bid scenarios, or is it a little bit too early for you guys to start looking at that? Uh, well, Coach Harris, she'll tell us, you know, to look, and uh, she kind of gets mad if we don't. So I think, you know, we look and. Because, I mean, you know, we want to at-large, but we don't want to, want to be in a position where we have to win the tournament, like, to go to the NCAA. And, you know, we're going to keep playing hard and trying to win every game just to put ourselves in that position. Is that a motivating factor, I guess, for you guys? When, when you guys look at the bracketology and you see that even though you guys have won so many games, are you're, you're still out of the tournament right now? Yeah, I think, you know, it's a big motivating factor. I mean, last year, you know, we were 30-5, and five and, you know, we weren't for sure in the tournament. We hadn't won the conference tournament. So, you know, we know we have to – come in every day ready to play we can't take any games off. What kind of challenges UAB have for you in particular? Uh, they're a really good team. I think they're really good defensively and they play hard. You know, they're, I think they're, I don't know, they have a pretty good record in conference so I mean it'll be a good game for us. And then how exciting is just play middle on Saturday and then do that rivalry again? You know, middle's always a good game and I think, I mean, they're a good team this year and you know, it'll be a really good game and a great atmosphere for us to play in. You mentioned you all were 35, 35 last year, and you know weren't sure if you were kind of so uh, cemented in the tournament this year. What the record being, what it is. You mentioned looking at getting in at large. I feel like there's maybe a little bit of nationally, people still don't recognize what you all are, are doing here. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I mean, just because we're not like a big school, BCS school, then you know we're not going to be guaranteed to get in the tournament or every year, even if our record is great like that. And I mean, I think people are starting to see that we're building our program back up and uh, you know we get votes in top 25 so I mean I think they're seeing what we're doing but we just have work to do still.